So a wide receiver that Oklahoma has offered has narrowed his list of schools down to six. The young man's name is Quincy Porter. And I feel we need to talk about this because we know Emmett Jones. We need to give him a raise. He's going out getting these big time wide receivers and he's recruiting at such a high level in that room. I, I mean, I am loving it, but as always, thank y'all for pulling up and we're going to get this party started right now on this episode of Sooner Legends Podcast. Well, welcome to this episode of Sooner Legends Podcast. I'm your host, Mike the Legend, and if you're new to the channel and new to the family, hop down and hit that red subscriber button and turn on your post notification bells. That way you won't miss any OU-related content that I will be publishing in the future. Could I get you to please give me a like and comment on the video because it helps push the algorithm of YouTube. And also, could you please share the video because sharing is caring. Well, as I stated at the front of my video at the beginning, that Quincy Porter out of New Jersey, Virgin High School, uh, Oradell, New Jersey to be precise, has whittled his list of schools down to six and this is a big time get for it. if we was to land him. He, he, I've, I've watched his, I've watched his highlights. Like I've stated in my videos, I can't pull up a video or it slows my, slows my stream down. But from what I've seen in his, in his highlights, there's one particular highlight that I watched. Uh, the quarterback through into double coverage. He catches the ball is right around the, I'd say the 20, 25 yard line. And you think he's tackled and he makes an angle cut. Touchdown. And from the other highlight videos I've watched, he's got tremendous speed. He is fast. He's a track star. I'm fixing to bring him up on here. Uh, good hands. I mean, he has got a great set of hands, has a good vertical leap that you'd want in wide receiver. And if y'all, if y'all paid attention, and I know you have because y'all's crazy Sooner fans like myself, that Emmett Jones is getting these six one, six two or better receivers for those jump balls when need be and from what i've seen with this guy i don't know his precise vertical leap but from what i've seen in his highlight reels he's got a he's got a dang good highlight reel and vertical leap so i'm going to bring him up and uh we're going to do this bingo Bingo. And here he comes. There he is. Quincy Porter, 2025 class recruiting from Virgin Catholic High School in Oradale, New Jersey. He is six foot three, 190 pounds, wide receiver. He's a four star composite, 51 nationally, seventh in the country, and number one in the state of New Jersey. He's also a track star. He, as a freshman, uh, he ran an 11.61 100 and a 23.37 200. And as a sophomore, he ran a 23. Five six two hundred, and 
for his uh, sophomore year in 2022, he caught 35 passes for 686 yards and 11 tutties on 19.6 yards per receptions. That is that that's doing it in anybody's books. That is cooking. And like I stated in his um, in his highlight reels, if if you watch once the ball is in his hand, he has afterburners. And he once he get gets the ball and gets the gets into that next level, he is he can he can cut on a dime and give you nine and a half cents change back. He's He's going to be uh, one of his attributes is going to be getting big yardage after the catch, which is what we refer to as yak, yak yards. And we're going to be needing him. We are, because if you look at the list of wide receivers that we have right now, you got Andrell Anthony, who's a senior, um, Jet. I'm just going to go through the seniors right now. Uh, Andrell Anthony, he's a senior. J.J. Hester, he's a redshirt senior. Jalil Farouk is a senior. And then we got some juniors in this class that could possibly declare for the NFL draft at the end of this season. So we're going to need a body like this to come in and whoever in that room besides the seniors declares for the draft we're going to need to need to uh need to pick up slack so to speak and uh but if you already look at this room i named the seniors but let's just go through them andrell anthony nick anderson jj hester jalil farouk jay gibb brennan thompson Dion burks jacques pedway just look at what emmett jones has has brought to us as a recruiter and I feel very strong about this recruitment. Emmett Jones is on fire, guys. And bringing in an elite wide receiver like this would definitely, definitely benefit OU and Jackson Arnold going into the 2025 season with the potential lot, like I was stating, with the potential loss of wide receivers in that room. So y'all hop down in the comments, tell me what you think. Is this going to be a good recruit for us? Are we going to get him? Do we have a chance? Y'all let the old legend know. We're going to get out of here. This is the legend. We'll see you on the backside. God bless and boomer sooner.